brief demonstration video of the Vacumatic Countess uh, optical counting machine with the ballot papers as supplied. We've got the uh, first batch pushed up uh, and presented. We have 177 pieces. We remove one from the top, 176, and replace it returning us to 177. Now, if we add a, a second batch, just jog it up a little bit, knock it up, because they need to be presented well. 370 now. Three sixty-nine. You can see the speed of the uh, count system. Um, let's add one more batch. It's higher than their jogging block now, but let's see if it works out. Yep, five hundred and ninety-six. Five ninety-five. So you can see the the ballot papers count very well. Um, and uh, the regularity and quality of the paper is uh, what's pushing that. Now we also wanted to quickly set up a new program to show you how easily this can be done. So we got uh, a new a sample, uh, some credit card type material. So to set a new program, I'll just zoom in a little bit. We simply raise a new file. Give the file a name, test 6 in this case. And then present a, a small pile uh, to the machine, 20 in this case, so that it can learn what it looks like. So we see we have 20, we save that to the file. and the new program is loaded. We can add now further pieces. Let's just present them in the right way. So you can see that setting a new program is literally the work of uh, uh, some seconds. So I hope this uh, shows the machine off. Um, we need to talk more about how it would work in your process but the counting of the uh, ballot papers is very effective.